the festival of colors is here happy holi everyone in the next few minutes let's see why we celebrate holi namaste everyone welcome back to zesty nimbu this is shri rekha if you like the content that i'm creating here then show your appreciation by hitting the like button and also subscribing to my channel holi celebrates the arrival of spring the end of winter spring time is the time where everything is rejuvenating the nature is rejuvenating from the cold and there is fresh starts fresh beginning for everything the nature is in its full glory during spring time and hence we celebrate this beautiful colorful festival by going and meeting our friends and family and spreading this joy this color in everybody's lives holi falls on a purnima a full moon day and the day before is celebrated as holika dahan holika is the sister of hiranyakashipu and uh, the aunt of prahlad because hiranyakashipu was unable to kill prahlad he requests his sister to do so and holika creates a fire she has a boon from brahma where she can create fire and she doesn't get harmed because of that fire herself but unfortunately for her she tries to kill prahlad with that fire and uh, prahlad escapes unhurt but she dies in the fire that she has created so that is why holika dahan is done on the day before holi and holi purnima is celebrated with gusto with joy to celebrate the burning of all bad things all old things and this is one of the stories this story is there in our puranas and the second story is of kama dahana kama the god of love god of desire is uh, burned to ashes by shiva so there is a rakshasa called tarakasura who requests a boon from brahma where he can only be killed by the son of shiva why is this a difficult boon because shiva at that time was in mourning because of the death of sati during the daksha yagna if you haven't seen the daksha yagna video go ahead and check it out in the link above as well as in the description box you'll understand what happened during that time so sati is reincarnated as parvati the daughter of himavat and maina devi she is parvati and parvati is also doing a great penance to attain to shiva the gods intervene and take the matter into their own hands wanting to create love between shiva and parvati so that tarakasura can be killed so they request kamadeva madana to go and create hit his arrows on shiva madana instead of doing his work properly instead of uh, you know doing it for the welfare of mankind goes about boasting that he can uh, even create love in shiva and no one can escape his uh, arrows but unfortunately for him this boasting is his great undoing so he goes and hits one of his arrows on shiva who is in deep meditation shiva comes out of his meditation there is love created between him and parvati but shiva is shiva he is the greatest yogi so he can control his desires his senses so he controls so he also wants to know who has disturbed him during his meditation he looks around and he finds the god of love kamadeva and uh, he opens his third eye and burns kamadeva into ashes that is kamadahana rati devi who is the wife of kamadeva requests shiva to bring back her husband shiva does that and says that only she can see and feel her husband and nobody else can feel his presence or see him after a lot of requesting after a lot of crying by rati devi she gets a boon that in dwapar yuga she will marry kamadeva's reincarnation who is pradyumna so pradyumna is the son of rukmini and shri krishna in dwapar yuga he marries rukmavati who is the daughter of rukmi rukmi is the brother of rukmini rukmavati is none other than rati devi so that way they again unite pradyumna and rukmavati in dwapar yuga so this story and the holika dahan story kama dahana and holika dahana are mentioned during holi to push us in the right direction of you know discarding old stuff discarding our desires bring in freshness have a fresh beginning all these things have significance in our lives this is the significance of holi the beautiful festival of colors and that we share with our friends and family i wish you all a very happy holi i hope you have liked today's video do like share comment and subscribe to my channel follow me on all the social media handles and i'll see you in the next video until then namaste wish you all a very happy holi